Heartbreaking news tonight from Omaha Children's Hospital. An alarming death of a toddler. Investigators in Bellevue accuse a young man of deliberately hurting the child. Good evening, I'm Craig DeGrelli. New at 10, reporter Maya Signs went digging for answers and is live with what she discovered. Miranda? Craig, the child was brought here for treatment, but tonight Bellevue police confirmed the one-year-old has died, just three days shy of her second birthday. Bellevue police detectives continue to investigate the death of a one-year-old. Police were called to assist with the rescue call in an apartment complex Sunday. Upon arrival, police found one-year-old Imani Edwards unresponsive in the bathtub. Once officers were on the scene, they began conducting an investigation. Uh, a, a drowning of a child is uh, obviously suspicious, so we need to determine what had occurred. During the investigation, police found that the life-threatening injuries suffered by the one-year-old were not accidental and were intentionally caused. Police say the girl and her baby brother were under the care of her mother's boyfriend, 25-year-old Armin Floyd, while she was at work. Police arrested Floyd for child abuse nearly 30 days after being arrested on another child abuse incident and domestic violence against the child's mother. Brianna Whitmore lives across the hall. She says seeing the unresponsive child was traumatizing. I seen the paramedic coming out of the building carrying the unconscious uh, child. And she had kind of like a purpley, bluish tint to her skin, like she maybe hadn't been breathing for a little bit. Whitmore says that as a mom, she can't begin to imagine the pain the family is going through. When I seen the paramedic coming out of that apartment and I seen that little girl for a brief second, I did not see that little girl's face. I seen my own baby's face. Bellevue Police is still investigating what exactly happened to the child, while the Department of Health and Human Services is currently investigating the welfare of the younger sibling. Reporting live from Children's Hospital, Maya Sines, KMTV Action 3 News. The 